He is said to be the largest and highest paid and best known wrestler in the entire world. This man stands seven feet four inches tall, weighs in at about 500 pounds. Please welcome Andre the Giant. Welcome back to Chaos Corner here on Guardian of Chaos, the YouTube channel. Sit back and enjoy the classic talk shows with all the legendary pro grapplers. Drop an elbow on that like button. Hear from the vault at Chaos Chronicles. Can I can I get you a mimosa? <laughs> what? Uh, uh, who are you going to be wrestling tonight? By the way, anybody that we would have heard of? It'll be uh, me and Tony Atlas and Rocky Johnson against the three Samoans. This, how, how many people uh, does the Cardinal? 20,000 in, in the uh, 18, 20,000? Upstairs, I get the, almost 23,000 people. And downstairs, I get 7,000 people. Oh, my. Uh, uh, now, what, what is the reaction of uh, the average person when they see you, like when you go into a bar or something? They don't really get out. They, uh, they all clear out. Uh, do, you, do you find that people are, are uh, uh, frightened by you, or, or do they want to pick a fight with you? Do you ever run into that? No. no. Yeah, what, what do they say when they see a man your size? Or when they see you? They can, <laughs> they can believe it. They just look at me. Yeah. yeah. Uh, what about traveling? Are you uh, hotel beds? Or are they a problem? No. You get... I try to find a hotel where they get a king size bed. Yeah. The worst is when I go to Japan. All those guys are so small. Right? Sure. Even in the hotel, I, I can go through the door, I can go to the bathroom. Right? I can... So but but uh, the nature of your job, you're traveling all the time, aren't you? Like 300, 320 nights a year. Yes. Yeah. Now, what about plane travels? Does that get old after a while? Awful? I go in first class, but I don't believe mine was it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what about airplane food? Is there any way for you to get filled up on a flight? Oh, yeah. Yeah? It was really that nice. It gave me two or three plates. Of yeah. Uh, now, speaking of food, you own a restaurant. Is it Montreal? Yes. Now, what kind of a French, re restaurant. French restaurant and um, expensive place? No, just a nice place, a good food. Yeah, and uh, do you ever work there? Yeah, I eat there. <laughs> you, you sure eat there, but, yeah. uh, but do you ever go in no. and, and greet the customers as they're coming in? No, no. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, how much time do we have here? Okay, we gotta, we got to go away for a commercial, but you can, you mind okay. sticking around, Andre? No, I don't Okay, mind. great. If you stay right here, uh, we'll continue talking with you. Uh, fans don't go anywhere we have more classic footage coming from here on the guardian of chaos the youtube channel because it's me it's the goc have you ever been injured in the uh, uh, ring many times and uh, is this uh, what we have here is this was this the result yeah. of a, a, a ring that was, injury that was the last time right. Andrew. good lord <laughs> um, what what size shoe do you wear 20 20 Good heavens, let's just, uh, oh, I'm going to get the stage hands in here to help him in this. Uh, what do you do when you're not wrestling? You, you're traveling all of the time. What do you do for fun? If you just want to just have a, a good night, uh, you know, you got a weekend off, what would you do on a Saturday? I go home. I go to North Carolina. Uh -huh. I got a house in North Carolina. And what, what do you do to relax there? I do some jolly time over there and walk in the woods and I got some cows and just have a good time yeah. and fun. And you, I, know, I know you enjoy drinking beer, don't you? Oh, uh, not anymore. You quit drinking beer? Yes. Now, you used to have a really, uh, an incredible appetite for drinking, didn't you? Right, for beer, yes. Is it true that you, had, in one sitting, drank 117 beers? Yes. <laughs> and, uh, did, did, uh, did that, were you drunk at the end of that? I don't remember, I think I passed out. <laughs> uh, but you don't drink anymore? Not since, uh, 14 months ago, I quit. Yeah. Uh, you feel better for not drinking? Yeah, because when I was drinking beer, I used to weigh 560 pounds. And you've trimmed down now to... Well, no, I'm 470. Yeah, I was going to say, you look, you look about 470. Uh, well, congratulations. Now, it, Thank you. Uh, how much longer do you think you'll be wrestling? I don't know, maybe tonight will be my last match with you. No, you no. Know. Uh, you never know what will happen in the ring. What, what would you do after you uh, uh, your career was over? I don't know. 
I'm in the Staten Farm or go walk in the restaurant, in my restaurant, yeah. take care of my business. And yeah. Well, it sounds like you're in pretty good shape. Out. You got the, the farm and the, and the restaurant, and uh, and you don't drink anymore. So what the hell? You're. I'll drink some white wine. You have a little white wine. Now, how much yes. white wine would you have at a meal? <laughs> But two or three bottles. Two or three bottles. So in other words, just fill up the shoe. And, um, now, uh, this afternoon we talked around in the office about having you lift me up, and you you just recently said you're not going to lift me up, right? Why don't you want to lift me up? It's okay. I mean, I'm, I'm sort of I, I glad. I'll tell you why, because one time I was doing an interview like this on TV, and the guy wanted me to pick him up. So I picked him up, and two weeks later he tried to give me a lawsuit because he said I heard it. Oh, no. Now, who was that? Oh, I don't want to go to my son's name. No, no. Was, no. Is, is it uh, somebody we might know? No. I bet it was Merv Griffin, wasn't it? <laughs> uh, you can't tell us, huh? No, I don't want to see. Okay, well, what time does the, the match start at uh, Madison Square Garden? It starts at 8 o'clock. All right, well, you got to get going, don't you? Oh, no, I just stay all night. <laughs> Sure, that's what we were hoping. We, uh, uh, sure, Andre, of course. You uh, you make yourself at home. It was a nice uh, nice meeting you, sir. And good luck to you. All right, fans, don't go anywhere. We're coming right back with more.